How to make coffee latte art in Photoshop. Latte art is the thing that baristas do by pouring milk foam into your coffee and then creating beautiful designs in it using various tools. Believe me, it's very hard to do. I tried it and I couldn't get it right ever. But I'm going to show you a very simple way to transform a photo into a beautiful coffee latte art design using Photoshop. I'm John. I'm a graphic designer and co-founder of the Photoshop blog psddude.com and this is my tutorial on how to create coffee latte art in Photoshop. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to make coffee latte art in Photoshop using a Photoshop mockup. We will do this in three steps. In step one, we will download and open up a Photoshop mockup for the coffee latte art effect. In step two, we will take a photo and place it in the mockup. And in step three, I will show you some customizations that you can do on the mockup. So let's get started. First, we will download the Photoshop mockup from photoshopsupply.com. You just go to the photoshopsupply.com website and go to the coffee latte art Photoshop mockup. And you can download this mockup for free. And I will place a link to this mockup in the description below. Just click on the free download link. And I already did that. So you will get a zip file that you have to extract and we'll do that here and the package contains a license file and a psd file and this is the coffee latte mockup uh, psd file which we will open up in photoshop when you open up the mockup in photoshop you will get this which is a beautiful mockup and uh, it contains a logo uh, in the coffee so we will want to replace this with our own photo but first we need to make a few changes to the mockup let's take a look at what the mockup has so it has several layers and if you go into this layer group and open up the layer group you will see that it has several layers and one uh, layer says that is uh, for text and logos and another one says that it's for image because for this photoshop tutorial we will use an image for our cafe latte uh, design we have to switch off this layer and turn on the layer for the image we can close this layer group and uh, we can continue with our tutorial by opening up the smart object in this layer where it says add your logo inside so we double click on the smart object and we get into it and we'll see that we have the original logo that comes with the mockup this is where we will place our image that we will transform into the coffee latte art design I will just use an image of the internet. Uh, I will uh, take one from Pixabay. I think this uh, portrait of a young girl is okay. I just right click on it, copy image and then back into Photoshop. I will create a new layer by pressing Ctrl, Shift and N. I will name this layer image and then hit enter. Then I will press Ctrl and V to paste the image and let's move it to the center. I think this looks good. The next thing that we need to do is to activate this coffee gradient. What this does it, uh, is it that it transforms the image into uh, the colors of the coffee. One thing that we have to do here is that we have to balance these tones uh, according to, to the image. Uh, and this is very easy to do if we go to Image, Adjustments and Levels. 
we can drag the midpoint such that we have a nice balance between the milky white and the coffee brown colors. I think this is okay. And then we close this smart object. Photoshop will ask us if we want to save and we click yes and our image appears on the coffee. This starts to look like a coffee latte art design, doesn't it? But we have a small problem and that is that the, the edges of the image are visible here and they are too rough. So we will go into this layer group and this is the layer with the image and we'll simply add a layer mask. So clicking on the um, layer and then choosing the layer mask. And then we will choose a, the brush tool and using a brush with the hardness set to zero. And we will need to paint with black inside the mask. And if we do this, we will start to hide parts of the image so that we don't see those rough edges. Yes, something like that. And don't worry, if you make a mistake like this, you can simply switch to white and start drawing in the image. Okay, let me make some adjustments. And this is it. Our coffee latte art design is complete. And now let's see what we can uh, customize further in this mocha. The first thing that you can do is that if you select this layer group and then choose the move tool, we can move the coffee cup around like we need, or we can even press Ctrl and T and we can make it smaller or larger depending on what we need. And another thing that we can do is that we have this uh, wood background that comes with the mock-up. If we want to use another background, that's very easy to do. And I will just head over to Textures for Photoshop where I will download a texture. You will get the link to this uh, texture in the description below. So you can download the, a texture from there and I already did that. And if I grab this image and place it into Photoshop, then resize it a bit such that it covers the entire canvas. Then hit enter. This is the way to change the background for this uh, uh, Photoshop mockup. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial on how to make coffee latte art in Photoshop. Using this same technique, you can get very interesting results by taking a photo of yourself or of family members and transforming it into beautiful coffee latte art. You can also use logos or text messages that you can turn into latte art designs to post on Facebook or your Twitter account to get lots of likes. If you like this tutorial, don't forget to like and subscribe for more Photoshop tutorials. And if you have any questions, just drop me a comment below.